The most common applications of the window films are promotional graphics, retailer stores, uh, storefronts, malls. Uh, you'll also see them on vehicle windows, buses, subways, and it's a great tool to bring in the customer, draw that attention, and to advertise that product. Uh, the product line of our window films from Avery Dennison include a variety of options. Uh, we have our window perforated films, our transparent films such as our MPI 2077, and also our specialty films, our SF100-103 Ultra Clear, and then our architectural window films, Etchmark and Frosted Sparkle. The most important considerations when installing a window film are the surface of the window. You want to make sure it is absolutely clean. Most windows you might have waxes, silicones, and to ensure proper adhesion you want to clean it with the proper solution. And we recommend isopropyl alcohol. It will make it clean and you'll be able to get the proper adhesion that you need. Now most installers like to use Windex. We do not recommend using Windex. It has certain chemicals that actually repel the adhesive over time. The average application time varies by window, depending on the size and also how many windows you're going to be applying on. There are also two different methods of applying window film. One is a dry method, the other is a wet method. So make sure to check the specifications for that product and which is recommended. If you make a mistake, you don't need to worry too much about it. On dry applications, you should be able to remove it as it is a removable adhesive and lay it down again. On a wet application, simply take it back off the window, reapply the wet application on the window and the adhesive, and lay it down. A few tips and tricks I'd like to let our viewers know is one of application tools. Our application tools, we have many different squeegees, and some of those squeegees will actually cut down on the friction and not scratch the window graphic. Another application tip would be make sure to measure the window properly to make sure it's not touching the moldings or the sides of the window. Those rubber moldings will actually repel the adhesive, causing the graphic to peel back on itself. And the third application tip I would suggest is really preference, and that would be how they'd like to apply it. And typically it is used with the hinge method, and they can do the hinge from the top or the middle, whichever they're comfortable with. If you have any questions at all, you can email us, you can check our website. We will have instructional bulletins, data sheets, and also instructional videos.